Shout out my boys, upscale detailing coming through. Fresh wash. Ooh, look at that. So, even though it is still kind of warm outside, uh, we're gonna put this thing back on the dyno. Just get a better estimate on what this thing is making. Let's uh, get over here to the shop, try to let the car cool down for a little bit. I might go get some ice too, just in case, because I feel like the damn thing gonna heat soak just on the way to the shop. <laughs> So I just pull in, you know, everything looks normal. I look to the left, I'm like, what the f <laughs> Yo, god damn. That's what my damn Z looks like right now. Damn, dog, you got the MB Battles, dog? Damn, fucker. Low key, I always wanted those wheels way back in the day. So just to drive here, the thing is already stupid hot. <laughs> Throw a little bit of ice on it for a little bit, you know. Trying to get the best number we can. Hmm. Now I have to get my fat side. Hmm, let me get this side yeah. there. That's hmm. what I'm better. Set it right here to cool it down. Then the hood fell on it. Like, what are the odds? <laughs> so that shit broke. Now there's lemonade all in my engine bay after I just cleaned the bay. And so now we turn it on, it's just smoking. It smells like lemonade. <laughs> all bad. see someone on street hours and their tire looks like this this is how you know they make torque and they spin on the freeway <laughs> crazy these are pretty much the final numbers 823 torque 785 wheel so at the other shop when we were done with the tune it was 717 wheel so yeah that's a big difference and mind you i didn't change anything this is just difference from the heat so the tune was there but i didn't get to see the numbers because the car was so hot so this is the true number 823 torque at 3000 rpm <laughs> that is insane it's crazy bro these things make so much torque Ah, big sigh. Uh, yeah, guys, this thing was supposed to be done, but, you know, we pretty much finished everything and hit a brick wall. I don't know. Don't know what we're going to do with this shit. Hopefully, we can figure something out very soon, because it got me in my feels. This car is entirely too sick to be not running. So, yeah, since this didn't run, and I was sad, I wouldn't buy the ZR1.
Man, I look at the moon. I'm gonna turn into a wearable fool. Damn. I think someone called the boys on me. <laughs> Back into this video. Whoa, that's something a little different. You guys are expecting this bet, huh? Well, I hope I got gas because I'm running a little late. I think I do. Yes, we do. We good. Oh, so, how about them apples? ZR1 made 785, 823 torque. Pretty damn impressive for a full bolt on car at around 3,400 pounds. That's definitely not bad. To answer everyone's question, bro, is the vent faster than the GTR? From like a roll race, I think from a 40, 45 roll would be a really good race. The vet would definitely start pulling probably around like fourth gear. Um, if I was to do a 60 roll, I'd definitely gonna go with the vet. 60 roll, second gear, I think dips. So I definitely think that it would take this car on the top end. Uh, keep in mind, obviously this car is about four or 500 pounds heavier. This one makes about 40 wheel less and the vet is overpowering it on torque uh, by over 100. So um, yeah, you gotta keep that in mind. But this thing right here, this dual clutch transmission, um, you know, these things shift hella fast. Kind of makes up for like another 40, 50 horsepower. If you want to put it that way, maybe before I get rid of it, I'll get a race with both of the cars. I really don't care. I'm 100% sure that the vet is gonna win on top end, so I'm not, I don't really care. But uh, it'd be a cool video. But besides that, guys, over here we do have the new merch that is dropping uh, this Thursday. I'm probably gonna upload this video tomorrow, which is Wednesday. So basically for you guys, tomorrow, new merch is dropping, man, and actually, Tomorrow, Thursday, is uh, your boy's birthday. Um, I am dropping the merch on my birthday. So if you guys want to give me a birthday present, just buy some merch. <laughs> Can you guys guess how old I'm turning? A lot of people think like 23, 21, 22. I've heard 19. I'm like, bro, I am turning 30 years old on Thursday. <laughs> your boy is a damn dad with no kid. Honestly, this is wild, man, because I, I truly feel like my 21st birthday was like not that long ago. Um, and damn man, nine years went by really fast. Um, the best advice I can give you guys, if you're, you know, 19, 20, you're just starting out, just making money, you know, you got goals, you got dreams, you wanna drive cool cars, um, just don't waste any time, honestly. Like, make every day count, don't waste any time, because it's gonna go by like that, I promise you, I really promise you, man. It's just, it's just crazy to think, like, that nine years it took me to get here for my 21st birthday, Another nine years from now, it's like, I'm gonna be 39, bro. I'm gonna be damn near 40 years old. So uh, life is, uh, it goes by really fast. Don't waste time. Don't sleep on opportunities. Just do what makes you happy. Even if it's not making you money right now, if it makes you happy, honestly, that is all that matters. You know, when we leave this earth, we can't take anything with us. You know what I'm saying? We were, we were born naked, we're gonna leave naked. So uh, man, that's all I can really say to you guys. I'm gonna be 30 years old in two days and I still feel like I'm at the bottom, man. Like I, I'm, I'm far away from where I wanna be. A lot of people look at me and they're like, oh, this guy has it all. Like he just does what he wants and he buys this car, buys that car. And that's only because you guys see what I post. You know? Don't look at my life like I have it all and like don't make what I have just your ultimate goal. And like once you get there, like that's it. You feel like you made it, trust me. <laughs> There's levels, man, and the levels don't stop. So uh, all you can really do is just keep striving for more. Just never give up. Keep going hard every day. It doesn't matter how much money you have. Like, you got to still keep going hard. Fast money, short-term money is honestly pretty easy to get. You know, it's, it's not too hard to obtain things. You know, if you just stack your money, save it till you buy what you want. But uh, it's 
it's really about the long term, man. Like, gotta start thinking about the long term money. You know, where the where, where's the money gonna be at in 10 years? Where's the money gonna be at in 15 years? Gotta think about that. And if you didn't notice, uh, the car sounds a little louder. It's the tires. <laughs> uh, I did swap out the R Triple Eights with the other R Triple Eights I had that were got a little bit more meat on the tires now, so they're a little loud. <laughs> uh, now that we drop merch, you guys can fully support me now, and you have been. So I want to truly, honestly, like thank everybody that's been copying all the merch. Um, the only reason that I keep dropping is because you guys keep buying. So uh, definitely shout out to you guys for everybody that's supported the merch. Um, I normally don't like to show the merch until I drop it, but it's cool. Uh, right now I'm on my way to link up with my boy. We're gonna take a few shots with the merch and stuff. Uh, once we get to the spot, I'll show you guys a little sneak peek. All right, guys, we are here at the shoot location. I didn't get a chance to wash the GTR. I was gonna take the vet to do this shoot, but I'm like, uh, I'm dropping like G35 merch. G35, vet, it's like, those two don't go good together. <laughs> I mean, shit, I think still looks good for not washing it for a few weeks. So, uh, so the r Ace that I put on, they were actually the older r Ace. they're not the R's. And uh, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I like these ones better. I just like the tread pattern more. And uh, if you didn't notice, um, uh, the older R888s are actually directional when you get camber wear. But with the R888Rs, they are outside inside. So you can't do that. <laughs> if anyone has a 285, 35, 20, and a 315, 30, 20, or a 325, 30, 20 in the old R888, not the Rs, Hit me up, let me know, I'll buy them. <laughs> I need them. Yeah, man, the GTR, like, ah, it gets me every time, like, it never truly hits me that I own this car. Like, it really honestly doesn't. I put 100,000 miles on it and I still wouldn't hit me, bro. I think it'll hit me when I break something that's really expensive. Then I'm gonna be like, ah, yeah, I don't want this shit anymore. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. I just hit, like, I'm about to hit 32K almost. No issues at all, man. Everything has been really good. Knock on carbon fiber. Damn, my boy pulling up here with the Yerbo. You heard that? But uh, yeah, guys, let's let's get to the merch real quick. So you already know what time it is. Full bolt on tune, bro. <laughs> so if you guys don't know what this is, this is a license plate frame. <laughs> For everybody that is full bolt on tune. You guys need that for sure. You need that. You know, I'm, there's probably a lot of you guys. Oh, I don't want them to know I'm full bolt on, but it's all right. Just buy it anyway, just because of the cost. So we got that. I'm gonna show you guys the hoodie in a second. Yo, don't don't be mad at me, guys. This is your guys' fault. So look, I truthfully didn't even want to drop hoodies. Honestly, I wanted to do tees like I did the last drop. But bruh. But guys, the numbers don't lie. The T cells compared to the hoodie cells, which makes no sense. It was like 80% more on the hoodie cells, and I don't understand because it's still hot. Uh, so, so sorry guys, this time I didn't bring any tees. That was kind of your guys' fault for buying so many hoodies. <laughs> I don't know, man. I guess you guys just like the hoodies more. I don't know. But uh, we got a new design for the hoodies. I'll show you guys that in a second. We also have a snapback, which I have on right now. Hold on, I'm trying not to hit a pillar right now. That guys, look at that beautiful ass car. Sheesh, broke my neck forever. All right, so since my boy is over there taking some shots of the DR, well, I'm just gonna show it to you guys because it drops pretty much tomorrow, anyways. Sheesh! Full bolt on tune, bro. There it is, guys. We got the RB26 that is in the G35. Um, slapped right there on the front. Right there on the hoodie, man. One of the best sounding motors in the world. Very nice. And then, of course, on the back. Sheesh, right there. Is that a Dome dog? All right, so um, mind you, this is just a sample. Um, on the actual one, the tail light is gonna be red. You know, I just wanted to do something G35 inspired since I do currently own a G35 and we are doing the RB. Um, it only made sense. Birthday drop, 
uh, limited, man. Uh, all these drops, they're only like a one-time drop. Like, I'm never gonna bring this back. That's why they're all limited. You know, a lot, a lot of people will hit me up and they're like, yo, bro, do you still have any left? And I'm like, nah, man, it was limited, dog. You can't sleep. So um, if you guys like it, man, cop it, support. See, uh, you guys already seen we have the plate frames right there. Anybody can rock that. I mean, even if you don't have bolt-ons, it doesn't matter. You can still rock with it. Uh, it's more of a movement, you know, something funny. If you know, you know type of thing. It's not full bolt-on tune, it's full bolt-on tune. <laughs> Story on this and how I came up with that accent. It's actually happened a really, really long time ago back when I had my G35. Uh, if you guys are familiar with SoCal area, um, I E O C L A, uh, near the LA area, there's a place called Glendale. A lot of like Armenian people out there in Glendale. So uh, one day, like this dude pulls up on me. And he's like, hey brother, what's, what's done to your car? I was like, intake exhaust. And I was like, what about you? And my boy was like, full bolt on tune, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's just funny man it's just funny it's classic so uh yeah i kind of always just like stuck in the back of my head and uh, I've, I've mentioned it a couple times in my older videos like not everybody has caught it because it's one of those things you really have to just catch but uh it's funny man so you know it's it's part of the movement now you know and you guys want to check out the hat Sheesh. there it is we got the snappy very nice. Look at that. Full bolt on. I was gonna put the, the bro on there, but I was like, ah, I don't think everyone's gonna understand. It's gonna look kind of weird with the bro on there. So it's more insider, but uh, we got the tome for the T. We got the yerbos for the O. Super dope. Honestly, it fits great. I got a little peanut head, fits perfect. If you wanna cop a snap, license plate frame, hoodie, you know what to do. The link is going to be in my bio. I believe I'm going to be dropping it on Thursday, uh, 3 p.m. PST time. So uh, don't miss out, man. Pretty much wrapping the shoot up in here at the first spot. We're going to go to another spot real quick. But we got all the shots of the merch done. I'm excited. Ho hopefully we have another successful drop and we sell out. If you guys don't want to forget about the drop, um, I will leave a link in the description to the uh, pre-launch site where you guys can subscribe. You guys can put in your email and you'll get a notification, I think maybe right before I drop it or as soon as I drop it. So you guys won't forget about it pretty much tomorrow, 3 p.m. Pacific time. Let's get it, man. Let's check it, we got the last spot. Vibes, how about the vibes? How's that looking 4K? Jeez. i do a little bit of light painting. Whoa, champ, you <laughs> don't get blurry. Whoa there. It's a dope spot. Bro, where is that? I don't know. Hey guys, check out the homie's Cobra right here. All right, check out the homie's Cobra right here. I just ran into him. So you missed it, um, your boy raced the Hellcat on the way back. Obviously when I passed him, I noticed his car stuff, but I wasn't like going fast or anything. I just passed him and he came back up zooming one of the smoke and I was like, all right, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up champ, hold up. So I should have pulled out the camera, but I mean, if I had my GoPro, I would have just threw the GoPro on, but it just happened real quick. I'll show you guys on the phone, you know what I'm saying? I, re I recorded it on the phone. I got the snap gap. I mean, I don't really be out here bullying like that, but if you pull up and you want the smoke, I'm down. <laughs> She, she's still on it too you hear that whine your boy's out of there this is how you know i'm a fair racer and i'm not just trying to jump on everybody and get the w on everybody this is how you know i'm a fair racer bro i let off and i got back on because he didn't go <laughs> one more time look off back on she's out of there your boy put the young bus. Well, that was that, guys. It is what it is. Now, I never said Hellcats are slow. Stock ones aren't the fastest, but some people think that the stock ones are just the fastest on the street. It just happens that way. I know that there's plenty of thousand plus Hellcats out there that are pretty quick. 
I ain't say shit, so don't go start instigating. And Bet you won't race my uncle's sister's cousins, Hellcat. Fully gutted, fully built, 85. Bet you won't race him. I probably won't, bro, because I don't care. Like, this is a random encounter, right? Some of you guys will never get it. But yeah, man, your boy about to go up in here. About to tear this wing stop up. Hopefully I didn't get no juice on my floor mat. That would suck. You guys, like I said, tomorrow, man, we are dropping the new merch. So um, if you guys like it, man, go cop. If you don't like it, just go cop something because it's my birthday. <laughs> but um, like always, man, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. Drop a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Like I said, the link will be in the description below. You guys can go over there, put in your email, and you will get a notification when I drop. This Thursday, 3 p.m. Pacific time. Don't miss out, man. Let's get it. Catch you guys in the next video.